Now, this channel has been largely focused on crypto and NFTs for the longest time, but my name is Knox Trays, and there's a lot of different kinds of collectibles that you can collect and amass and trade, or just hold on to them because they're fun and pretty and they give you nostalgia. For me, one of those things that I always find myself circling back to are Pokemon cards. And this begs the question, where do you go to trade Pokemon cards? One of the center places to actually go to trade authentic, real, graded, classic Pokemon cards like 1st Edition Shadowless Charizard, like 1st Edition Shadowless Venusaur, like 1st Edition Shadowless Mewtwo, is eBay. But then this begs the question, how do you know that what you're getting is real? is authentic, even though they come in the PSA boxes, like we see right here, if I can kind of get it in the screen, in focus, yeah, you can see the PSA box and it shows you the grade. How do we know somebody didn't just steal these or print them off or anything like that? eBay gives you, in some cases, an authenticity guarantee where they, along with the card graders themselves, review the card before it actually gets shipped to you. It gets shipped from the seller to the reviewer, then from there to you. And then the reviewer at the card review place packages it up in a very nice authenticity guaranteed packaging so that you feel assured that your card has gone through the process. And in this video, I'm gonna show you what that process really feels like or really looks like. And then we'll also take a look at what unboxing one of these things actually looks like. Let's go. So here I am on ebay.com. Let's just do a quick search for one of the hottest Pokemon cards that exists right now, the Umbreon VMAX Alt Art. This was part of the Evolving Skies expansion in Sword and Shield. And for whatever reason, people really gravitated towards this Pokemon and just ran the price up on this thing, even though its rarity is on par with some of the other cards in the collection. That being said, it is extraordinarily rare and is extraordinarily nice to look at. Immediately, right here at the top of the screen, your eyes should be drawn to this. Authenticity guarantee. This means that when you buy one of these cards, the actual card graders themselves are going to intercept this, so to speak. The seller is going to ship this card to the uh, authenticity card graders first before it gets passed on to you. The authenticity, uh, the authenticity graders actually review this card and then ship it onward from there. Now, where do you see this differs? Right over here. This one that's shipping from Brazil does not come with an authenticity guarantee, even though it is a PSA 10 gem mint. You're still rolling the dice just a hair because this means that this seller is going to ship it directly to you and what you get is what you get. Whereas if you pay, you know, a few hundred bucks extra, you will get the authenticity guarantee. So how bad does this slow down the process? Well, let me show you. Pulling up my own package that I just purchased and just got, this is a PSA 5 Pokemon Mewtwo holographic base set first edition that is coming in here. Therefore, you know, this is a pretty nice card. You can actually see the price right over there. I'm not trying to hide that. It's PSA 5, it's not PSA 10, but PSA 5 is still excellent condition. And for me, just to feel nostalgic, I'm not trying to flip these cards, at least not right now. I just wanted to hold these and take a look at them. So how long did it take for this to go through the authenticity guarantee and then to me? Well, if I scroll up just a hair, we can actually see the timeline right here paid on July 2nd, which I think that was a Sunday, delivered on July 11th, that was yesterday, a Tuesday. So all in all, about six business days, you know, to get from point A of paying it, uh, I probably shipped, I know it says July 2nd is when it shipped, but I think that was a Sunday, so they probably just printed the label. It was probably actually shipped on July 3rd. July 4th, of course, is a national holiday, so nobody was really working there. Then 5th and 6th and 7th and so on, all the way to July 11th is when it was actually delivered to my door. So when I get it received, 
what does it actually look like? Is this thing just dangling around in a box? Or is there something inside the box that assures me that this was graded, uh, reviewed, and guaranteed to be authentic? Now, we're going to take a look at one that I just received today, a Raichu. Now, this is the box that it gets delivered in. It looks super torn up because I attempted to remove the shipping label for what I hope are some pretty obvious reasons. I don't want anybody to know where I'm having these devices delivered to. So there we go. This is it. It's still sealed all the way around. You can see it gets sealed on pretty much all these sides right here. And what happens when we open it up? I actually think the presentation of this is actually super, super impressive. So I'm just going to kind of cut open one side right here. You really only have to open one side to get this to open. I'm going to just kind of tear it off right here on the corner and just pry it up like so. And what you'll see on the inside at this point is if I hold this little flap down, you can see the book that the card itself is delivered in. It's kind of delivered in a hardback book which also doubles as a stand. So as I pull it out, like so, this is what is inside the box. This is magnetic, which I think is pretty nice. You'll see how that's used in just a second. You, up, you open this flap right here, this flap right here, and it says congratulations on your recent purchase. This is how it was authenticated and graded with authenticity guarantee. Then it reveals the card itself like so and it's even held in a little stand you can actually kind of fold this up like this you can see how it would actually stand on its own this is magnetic here on the bottom again so it can stand up on its own which is actually super nice and then when i hold it like this this is the card now you can take it out of course and right here on the back notice it's sealed with an authenticity guaranteed, it says this eBay authenticity is void if broken. So it does come in this kind of wrap that's a PSA wrap. You can see right there, it's kind of flexible. So it's a PSA uh, authenticity guaranteed wrap sealed along this crease right here that guarantees that it is in good condition. So this is what the eBay authenticity guaranteed packaging looks like and how you know what you're getting is an authentic card with an authentic grade.